The following program contains mature subject matter not suitable for young viewers and graphic images that may be disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Brianne asked her question on the Facebook page of the doctors. I keep getting a bump on my booty near my tailbone. It's painful red and pus comes out. What is this and how do I stop it from coming back? It sounds like a pylonidal cyst. Exactly. Pylo needs, means hair, nidal means nidus of infection. And what happens is, and I'm, I'm a believer there are multiple theories, in, in the trauma theory where we, we're sitting on our, on our bone and then when the tissue rubs and you get a little bit of a, a, a shear damage and a little bit of bleeding, what happens is you get a little blood there and the blood gets reabsorbed and now you have an empty space which is like a vacuum with negative pressure. And every time we move it just keeps pulling down, pulling down and it pulls the hair from the top down into the cyst. And I'm a believer in that theory because after doing thousands of the surgeries, it always goes down right above the periosteum of the sacrum. And it's just, the cyst always goes down in that area. And what happens is there's, there's long strings of hair, there's fluid inside and it eventually gets infected. And I just drained one three weeks ago and this gentleman had been suffering for two years and he just constantly draining and... <laughs> But, but but no, it's yeah. serious, yeah. And, and there you go. Yep, and, and it has that was me, but that is, I had to make a really big incision because his his cavity, mm -hmm. the cavity under there is actually much bigger than that looks. It was the size of like a, a, a probably a plum. Yeah, believe it or not, this is something, I can say this. As, as an ER doc, yeah. I, I probably see this as much as any other yeah, doctor sure. in the world. People I, I can't even tell you how many pylonidal abscesses I've had to drain in my career because it, they keep coming back, back. and they yep. keep coming back. And it's harder, they're in young kids. They're in mm -hmm. 17, 18 year olds, so I drain it and I say, you're gonna feel much better, it's gonna calm down, scar down, but we really need to do the surgery, but they don't come back because they feel good until two, they three years back. later, it gets big again and that's and when we finally do the surgery. And so yep. and this is another really good question.